I am actually shocked that these are my fresh wash day results. You guys need to hear about these products. What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Brandy and you're watching The Glam Bell and today I am doing a product review for y'all. I've really been wanting to test some of these products out. That is the Bumble and Bumble line. I've received a few packages from them um, and I've tried a few products here and there but I've never done a full wash day lineup. So today I wanted to just go in on these products and just test quite a few out and see exactly how they worked on my hair type. I do have low density, pretty thin, curly hair. I have about a 3A, 3B curl type. Curl type really doesn't matter. If you have similar hair and you want similar results, then I definitely recommend you sticking around. I'm gonna go over the products that I used to receive these results. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please, please, please make sure to hit that subscribe button down there and make sure to turn on the bell so that you don't miss any future uploads. Without further ado, we're gonna jump on in to this video. And before I jump into this wash day lineup, I do want to thank Dossier for partnering with me on a small portion of today's video. You guys have heard me talk about this company time and time again. I adore them. They are a tried and true brand for me. They are a luxury inspired perfume company. All their products are made in France. They have clean ingredients. They are affordable. They are cruelty free and I just adore them. Dossier has fragrances for women and men. They also have unisex scents that are good for men and women. Their prices are so affordable and you can find some of your favorite, favorite fragrances that you can find in retail stores for a fraction of the cost. Here is what it looks like. It comes in this cute little box and it has your little insert that talks all about your perfume. Use this little tester to test it out. If you don't like it, you send it back for a complete refund. And the coolest part is that they donate all the perfumes that are unwanted to charity and so no perfume goes to waste. I got two new perfumes this month and I'm gonna share them with you. I just got over COVID so my sniffer, my scent, is not quite back 100%. So it's gonna be interesting for me to kind of test these out and smell them. But the first one that I got is called Gourmand White Flowers. And it's inspired by Flower Bomb, which is a perfume that I love and adore. If you find a fragrance that you typically use like Flower Bomb, the fragrance that you get from Dossier is 100% a exact dupe of that perfume. So I, they've never, never, never steered me wrong. So let's see. Oh yeah, oh, y'all, oh my gosh. These fragrances last on the skin so, so well. Y'all, this one is definitely a winner. I love it. It smells exactly like Flower Bomb. Okay, the next one is right here. This is called Musky Oak Moss. And this one is inspired by Creed's Adventus perfume. I'm gonna spray this on a paper towel just because I already have the other one on my skin. Ooh. This almost smells like a men's cologne. Did I get a men's cologne? This is a men's fragrance. I thought I got one for my husband, but I couldn't remember if I got it this month or if it was last month, I don't know. If you have a man in your life, if you have a husband, if you have a significant other, this one is incredible. If you have not tried Dossier yet, I highly, highly, highly recommend them. They are amazing. I mean, superb quality in my opinion. I'll leave all of their information linked in the description box and I also have a little discount code for you guys so you can save a few bucks off of your purchase. And now let's get back to our regularly scheduled program, our Bumble and Bumble review. <laughs> I've received this product line from Bumble and Bumble. It's been a little while ago. It hasn't been too, too long, but I have held on to it because I wanted to try it so bad. I love that all of these brands are coming out with bond building systems. And this one is the Bumble and Bumble bond building system. They have a bunch of different products in this line that is designed to repair and strengthen the hair. All of my bond building products have really been the game changer in healing my hair from the inside out. These are the four products that I received, but I only used three of these products. I decided to use the Repair Shampoo. All of these products have honey bond building complex 
in them. I decided to go in with the repair treatment. Then for styling, I decided to go in with this product right here. This is the Bumble and Bumble Repair Styling Cream. I can't just use a styling cream because just styling creams don't typically do well with my hair. So I remembered I have these products right here from Bumble and Bumble. This is their BB Curl line, their Bumble and Bumble Curl line. I decided since I'm going in with this styling cream that I was going to follow it up with this mousse. Let's go ahead and jump on into my wash day. I'm gonna walk you through step by step, talk to you about these products and why I chose to use them. And I'll come back with my final thoughts. All right, here we are, another day, another wash. So I'm about to go in with some of the Bumble and Bumble products. Here's the whole lineup of products that I currently have from them. We are starting off with the Repair Shampoo, which goes for $31. And this is for heat, color, or chemical damage. And it has Honey Bond Building Complex in it, which helps repair the hair from the cortex to the cuticle. Helps to strengthen, defrizz, smooths, shines, hydrates, all those things. Good for all hair types. And yeah, so we're going to go in with that first and I'm just wetting my hair initially, of course, and then going in with the shampoo and this shampoo actually has a really good lather. Now it does have sulfate in it. These products are not Curly Girl Method approved. I want to make sure that you guys know that from the beginning. Uh, if you're looking for silicone free, sulfate free, these are not going to be the products for you. But overall, I feel like the shampoo really cleansed my hair and my scalp well without stripping my hair. That's really important to me. Now going in with the repair treatment and this product is to literally repair the hair, reverse the look and signs of damage in the hair. This product retails for $34. And what I love about this is that you only leave it in for five minutes. So you can use this treatment in the shower. I just go ahead and wash my hair first, put this treatment on, and then do everything else in the shower that I need to do, and then rinse it out before I get out the shower. So it just makes it really easy. This product, y'all, whoa. You talk about like feeling silky smooth. I can't even I can't even describe to you how my hair felt. It felt so silky. I am like obsessed with this. I had zero tangles. I really enjoyed both of these. Okay, now it's time to style. We're going in with the Repair Styling Cream. This product really helps with breakage and split ends, and it also helps to protect against heat. Uh, this product does have alcohol and dimethicone in it, but it also has polyquats in it, which helps against humidity. You know I love that. Again, these are not Curly Girl Method approved products. Um, okay, so now I'm just making sure that every tangle is out, which I had zero tangles after that repair treatment that was just insane okay going in with the styling cream first uh, you can use this to air dry or blow dry the hair of course having curly hair I'm just using this to add moisture and give my hair that heat protection now it's time to go in with the bumble and bumble curl mousse this product has ingredients like avocado coconut jojoba shea those things are very hydrating and help to reduce frizz so I really love that uh, this product does have glycerin which usually doesn't do well in the summer for me but it also has polyquats which definitely help to protect against humidity so I love that uh, this product, I was scared that it was going to be really light on my hair and not enough hold. So I really kind of went in and used a very generous amount. Um, I may try to use a little less the next time I use this and see how it does. But I really wanted to make sure that my hair was completely coated and had enough product that it was really going to make a difference, if that makes sense. Um, and I could tell already while I was scrunching that it was looking very promising. Anytime I can scrunch my hair, my hair really holds the curl shape, I can tell that it's gonna be a decent wash day. And this is what it was looking like right before I dried my hair. And here we are 100% dry, and this was right after I finished diffusing. I mean, immediately after. And I am, honestly, I'm shocked. Like, I'm shocked at the results that I got. The volume, the definition, the hold. I mean, it it really did give me everything that I was looking for. My hair looks a little bit dry. I feel like I could use a little shine, um, but overall, I'm so impressed. 
I have some final thoughts and opinions about these products. The repair shampoo worked amazing. I loved it. It lathered up on my hair a little bit, which I really love. I feel like I get a more intense wash with products that lather up. Even though it does have sulfate, it did not strip my hair. So I really loved this and I definitely will be using this again. I feel like this product is the standout product to me in this lineup. My hair literally felt like silk after using this. I can't even describe how soft and silky my hair felt. I loved that I only had to leave it in for five minutes. This made it easy to treat my hair very quickly. Loved this, definitely will be using this again. The Repair Styling Cream, again, worked really, really well. I wasn't sure what to expect with this, but it actually did not weigh my hair down at all. That's what I was most afraid of. Love that this protects against heat up to 450 degrees, so blow drying my hair, diffusing my hair is not going to cause any damage because I've got a heat protectant in it. I really enjoyed this product, y'all. Last but not least, the Bumble and Bumble Mousse. This product, I wasn't sure if it was going to give me enough hold. I was really worried that this product was gonna be a little bit too light and that my hair would just kind of fall flat a little bit. So I did go a little bit ham with this product. I mean, I did use quite a bit of it. This product is pretty pricey and with the amount that I used, I probably wouldn't be able to make this last very long, but I really do feel like using that little extra product made all the difference in the world. I mean, my hair has hold it has hold but it's not crunchy it's got mega definition anytime i've got a little bit of hold it really helps to hold my curl pattern so i think the mousse uh, definitely had something to do with that as well the only negative thing that i'll have to say about i think it's coming from this product is that my hair does feel a little bit dry i don't know if it's because i use a whole lot of this product or if it's maybe the alcohol that is in this product. All I will say is that my results are amazing. I might need a little moisture boost in a few days, um, but I do think that my definition is going to last and that my wash day is gonna, gonna last with these. One con to these are that they are pricey. If you have the extra money and you're not someone that is looking for Curly Girl Method approved products, then I would say try these out. If any of you have tried these products, I would love to hear from you and see what your thoughts and opinions are on them. There you go. There is my first impression of the Bumble and Bumble line on Curly Hair. I hope you guys really enjoyed today's video. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you in my next video. Peace out.